So today I'm visiting quite a remote place and quite a unique building and Tommy has come along. So maybe we're just heading up to this place called the Pineapple and it's named the Pineapple for reasons you're about to see soon. Wow, look at that. That is awesome man. Totally awesome. Such a unique building. Is that 1761? I think it is. Kind of feels like there's something missing for there. Anyway, there's another reason we're up this way. We are going to visit an abandoned stately home, which is in quite a state of ruin, but still plenty there to see. So we're going to head up there. It's quite a hike from here, but once we get there, you'll be able to see it as well. Is that a path? Yeah. Oh, yes, Hope so. Hopefully that'll take us right up to the house. Something's done away with Tommy. Worst case scenario with it. We end up in another field. The path's kind of like staggered man. Whoa, there's the house there. Right there. Oh this place is something else. This would be the servants' entrance, tradesmen entrance at the rear of the, the property. Man, I absolutely love this place. Oh, look at it, man. Look at that architecture. Look how many chimneys are up there. It is impressive. I hope you guys like this. Family coat of arms. Wow. Imagine this place back in the day. Just mind your feet where you're putting your feet, Thomas. Yeah. Yeah. Obviously, like all the flares and everything have all since rotted out. A lot of these rooms must have all been wooden panelled. And our fireplace up there. So cool. Whoa. That's quite freaky. It's all that weight sitting on the. Metal beams. Whoo! It was a little bit. Some plaster work still there. Like you were the owner back then. How old is this house? A good few hundred years old, I think. I need to do some more research on it. That would have been where curtains hung. Yep. You stand here drinking your morning tea. Yeah. How do we get yeah. out today? It's a lovely day. Mr. Belvedere, <laughs> get the door. <laughs> it looks like Farnsworth is arriving again. Uh, <laughs> who goes there? You, poor person. Yes, that, that I employ. Yes, go and run along. But I wouldn't so go in them. <laughs> <laughs> here, we need some coal for this fire. Go and mine it. Thank you. <laughs> 1822. 1822. Still, still very old. Years ago, so how does a place like that get built and then, within that time scale, it end up like this? Though, eh? Shocking. Well, we have a fireplace. Well, I suspect if you want to get a fire going. Aye, it's freezing, man. <laughs> oh, I saw it as a bird's nest on the, on the fire hearth. Easily excited. I was talking about my torch. <laughs> it's like a central heating system, I think it is, you know. 
I think that's like an old furnace. And these will be like heating flumes that carry heat up through the house, like central heating. That's like almost Roman an idea, isn't it? It's like the Romans had the underfloor heating and stuff like that. Let's go here. <laughs> <laughs> Liqueurs. <laughs> oh, that's nuts. Whoa. Sorry if I'm going a bit fast with the camera, but I'm trying to take everything in. Too fast, in case something jumps out at me. You can barely see where I'm going here. And there is a piece of glass from one of the original bottles of wine. It's a pity it was near a hail bottle. <laughs> so they had electricity installed at some point. It seems like it's just really like all two core cable in the air. Another dark hole. Hit you first, Thomas. Ah, <laughs> oh, look at the big hinge. Shit, I put my phone off. Hang on, I get my torch back on. Note yourself, do not forget torch next time. Look at that hinge. That in itself is really lovely. There's a pipe on the ground here. What's this wee bit? Tommy? Mm -hmm. How you been? Whoa! Oh wow! That's spooky man. Do you see these wee candles? Thomas? You see, there's wee candles in every one of these sections here. Oh, it's like devil worship or something, man. How far does this go? Ah, <laughs> 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 oh, man, I nearly died. <laughs> Sorry. It's like heart failure mode. <laughs> Someone else is here. Photo bomb. Oh, wow. <laughs> 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 yeah, right but the floors are a bit dodgy in that, so just mind oh, how you go. Just stairs down that way. I enjoy visiting places like this. It's kind of a hobby of mine, and obviously I like sharing it on YouTube so other people can see these places. And a lot of people, I used to watch a lot of YouTube videos myself, and I used to think, you know, well. Some of these places I'll probably never see in my lifetime. So it's good to get these places documented before there's nothing left. Post them online and then anybody anywhere in the world can watch them. And not just that, I mean there's people who kind of... People have like disabilities and people that kind of travel, they kind of get out of the confinements of their own room. So I would like to think that somebody would sit and enjoy these videos and get a sense that they're travelling sort of thing and experiencing these places for themselves so that's basically it so as I say please like, subscribe and share thank you and next the stables that ivy's really nice climbing up the wall there yeah. it's nice to see some of the windy frames look at that it's like an external electric socket exposed to the, the weather Oh my, wow. That is mental. That's one way to get power outside. Authorised personnel only, and then unauthorised persons at own risk. Yeah. <laughs> I'm looking at the paint they used in that door. Green paint. Cool. Birds are loving in the ivy. Yeah, I know. Uh, even the flares are away in here, man. God, look at the old power 
next switch. Uh, unfortunately, I kind of woke up here, so as you can see, the floor's too weak. That's pretty nice. Pretty nice, some nice fireplaces up there. Must have been like kind of 11 quarters. Well, guys, that is the end of our stately home visit. So I hope you've enjoyed it as much as we've enjoyed it and we'll be bringing a lot more footage like that from other places for you to enjoy also. Peace out. Peace out Thomas. Peace out. Alright, so enthusiastic. <laughs> See you later guys.